Gamer Dude 288, and we're back for another video for MMEG Might and Magic Elemental Guardians. And today we're going to talk about just some of the things that I would like to see in the game personally. Some things that they can possibly incorporate, some things that I've have uh, heard talked about in the community, and things of that short sort. So, everybody knows that we've been having issues with the chat and everything and all of that stuff. It's not quite working properly. Sometimes it's up and sometimes it's down. I'm sure that they're on it. They're working on to fixing it and everything like that. But there's one thing that I wanted to add about the chat and everything. And I said this also briefly in a previous video where I had a video and summoner's war it was actually my very first summoner's war video and i probably have it in an i card or whatever but it was called down in the pm and it was practic it was practically talking about having a pm system in the game where you can private message every and private message people because um being able to communicate is important and i mean i i use outside communication as best as i can um uh, but still want to have a better inside the game communication system and private messaging is the way to go. And, and it took them a while, for, it took come to us a while to implement it into Summoner's War and hopefully here and with uh, Ubisoft's game, it doesn't take them that long to implement it as well. But the first thing first, they have to fix the chat the way it is. They gotta fix that first. But afterwards, maybe they can look for look further into uh, fixing, uh, implementing that into the game. It will be it will be pretty beneficial and helpful, especially uh, chatting with with your guildies and everything. Maybe you want to speak to someone specifically. And I know I'm having a tough time getting getting the communication factor together. Even when the chat is active, I'm having a tough time getting the communication factor together. So if I was able to send a private message to uh, to the people in my community, uh, that would help me out a lot better. Because then I know how to weed out the weed out the weak links or the people that just n not want to work with us, and and how to uh, congratulate the people that are and things of that nature. The guilds. So that's kind of, I really like these guild these guild quests that that we have. They're pretty interesting. They're pretty expensive to start and do and everything, but they're but they're really interest. They're really interesting. It, it gives us all something to do, something to work towards, and give us experience and all kind of other uh, materials and everything we need. But this shouldn't be the only thing that the guilds do. This shouldn't be no by any means and I, I figure you know it's just it's just the beginning it's just the launch so we already got a great deal of content but hopefully within the future they will be able to implement some form of guild war so guilds can battle with each other that's always cool that was one of my favorite things something more i enjoy doing i enjoy doing the guild battles in that game probably yeah probably my favorite way of pvp in in that game and um, I'm sure if they had some form of a, a, a Guild War type of thing in this, that would be interesting as well. Yeah. I mean, they can do they can do something similar. They can do something different. Uh, I mean, just as long as we have something to uh, battle it out, just to show who's the top Guild, who's the best Guild, and all of the server and all of that, that, that would be interesting to have. I mean, tell me what your thoughts are, because I like to know. Here's, a, here's one that um, I don't think should be implemented, like, right away. Something maybe a year from now. Um, granted, the game actually prosper and does well. Is having live battles. Having some form of a live PvP system so I can fight someone in real time. And we can all duke it out that, that way 
that will be really interesting to also have is a live battle feature. Now, like I said, I, I w wouldn't say that would be something that should be implemented anytime soon, not even within the next six months, maybe a year from year from now. I'll let the let everybody get familiar with, what, with how the game plays, what's going on, get a lot more people at the top of the uh, rankings in the game, and then as we get those new players, they have something to look forward to because we all be up there f in a grudge match beating the brakes off of each other in the arena and possibly the Guild Wars if that's around and has something else to do. So that'll be pretty in uh, pretty interesting. Please leave comments down in the comment section. Let me know what you think because we're giving out some good stuff here. This is fire. This is fire. Boom. Next point I want to add is the possibility of six starry. Now, this actually is something that made me really think uh, another game I play, uh, Final Fantasy Brave Expeditions. Now, they have the five and the six star, six star type of thing, like most games. This game chose to go the opposite, go go a different route by decreasing the star grade rather than having a star, star grade the same. But with Final Fantasy Break X, they have something called the seven star meta, where, you know, everything was already maxed at six star, but they added in another star grade and some extra add-ons and cool stuff like that. I think that will be really great to have in this game as well. And that'll be something else that I'll say maybe a year down the line as well. Not something that just should be thrown in right away, but something to be look to look forward to uh, a little ways down the road and having some form of a six-star meta com coming into this game. I know I was talking to somebody... Uh, recently that was saying like no they wouldn't like they wouldn't like that and that's that's fine though but I think it'd be cool just to have that but right now I mean it's great just the way it is but it'd be cool to have like some kind of power creep like that later on because I mean all games generally have some form of a power creep. this is another one that uh, has been talked about which is my last point that I'm going to make um, is the first skill when you evolve, you get random first skill. I want to be able to choose what I get on my first skill. Or, I mean, since this is one of those games where it, where things is done mostly random, which should have some kind of guaranteed stuff in a game like this, but that's just me. That's just me. But since it is a random game, it'd be nice to have a reroll function. Some way you can just possibly just reroll. You use maybe some of the materials you you get um, at the tower houses or something, and you spend that material and whatever amount that it takes, and it rerolls, and then you can do that x amount of times or whatever, and reroll until you get what you want or. Or whatever how that or whatever how that goes. Maybe if it was just like a 50-50 rate, 50% that you get this, 50% that you get that. So you know, so you still have a, a good amount of chance of getting whatever you wanted, the skill that you wanted, rather than well, if I gotta just accept that I got the skill that I don't want on this great unit, so their potential is not as good as I would like it to be to fit the kind of team that I'm building. Cause that's just that's just sucks. That, I mean. There's no way of getting around getting around how blatantly mediocre, I think is the word I want to use. I'm trying not to be mean here. I'm trying not to be mean and I can be mean, but it's it's a bad it's just a bad mechanic to be honest. It's just a bad mechanic and I think that could be done better. But that's just my thoughts on it. Tell me what are your thoughts? Do you what do you do you agree with what I'm saying? Do you disagree? Do you like it? Do you hate it? Do you have something that you think should be implemented into the game? So let's talk about it. And this is the Gamer Dude signing out. See you in another one. Deuces.